Hello, my name is Michael Kennedy. I play drums in the band The Wonder Years. I've been playing drums since eighth grade. I've been playing music since like third grade. My mom tried to get me into piano, then flute, more civilized instruments, yada yada. I ended up making friends with a bunch of guys who were like Slayer and Metallica and Slipknot. It's like, these guys are really cool. I'd really like them to be my friends. Well, they all happen to be drummers, so I started playing drums. And I kind of wandered through that for a while quite talentlessly. And I kind of just stuck with it through high school, I learned all of my rudiments. So even if I was a bit of a high school goof off about it, I was still always playing and I was in more bands because I was, I guess, friendly and weird. So people would invite me to play with them and I would learn a new style. Maybe poorly learn that new style, but I'd carry on. Uh, right at the end of high school, Six friends I had made just in the local scene playing in different bands decided to get together and we had one practice and that one practice was the formation of the Wonder Years. Halfway through college, I guess the internet existed more uh, and like our MySpace songs got a little more attention so we started playing a, a show in New Jersey or a show in upstate New York here and there. In the seriousness of it, it almost like it snuck up behind us before we really realized it. But then all of a sudden this opportunity appeared to be a professional drummer and to be a professional band, so we took it. And we were serious about it, and we tried really hard, and we practiced a lot more, and we stopped doing things like drinking before shows, uh, and it kind of got better from there. And now, uh, six years later of full-time touring, and full-time taking it seriously, uh, we've done quite well for ourselves. Uh, I've been a professional touring band for about six years now. I've gone through a lot of endorsements. A lot of people have treated me very well, and I, I wouldn't be here without them. A uh, funny fact about drumming, a lot of pieces, and most of them are quite expensive. Uh, without a support system ranging from my mother all the way up to now Zildjian, the best cymbal company ever, I would have floundered and failed. I would have just gotten a job somewhere, and that would have been it. For about seven months now, I've been with Zildjian, uh, and I have to say, kind of a big old dream come true. When I was a little kid, every Christmas or birthday, my mom would get me you know, a new Zildjian like 16 inch crash or like a 10 inch splash. And by the time I was done high school, I had like 15 Zildjian cymbals of all makes and models and qualities. I didn't, I didn't know, you know what I mean? My ears couldn't handle that. But now I'm a big boy and I get the real deal and it's great and it feels nice. Right now, I'm playing 15-inch new beat hi-hats, uh, A's, and I'm playing a 23-inch A sweet ride. Those are my brights, and then for darks, I have a 20-inch K crash and a 21-inch K crash ride. I kind of like to split those up so that my primary cymbals, the ones I'm, you know, like, keeping time on, have a, there's six guys in the band, there's a lot of sound. Uh, it's a little brighter, and it kind of keeps the cymbal tone above that, gives it some clarity. And then for the big accent parts, the heavy parts, I can go full bore with these more complex, darker sounds. <laughs> 